I've long been enamored with the Mississippi River. I've touched it at a few points. New Orleans, St. Louis, Iowa come to mind. And today, near its birth in, Miss in Minnesota, really quiet spot here. And what really inspires me about this river is a couple things. One is all the different spots it hits along the way and all the people it touches and as it moves and flows it touches other people and when you touch this river at any point you're touching all the people that have touched that river before and after right and also not just geographically but historically so all the people that touch this river throughout all of history you know going back to the, the first peoples that have been here you know um, real characters and also imaginary characters and fictional characters. I think of Tom Sawyer and Huckleberry Finn and Mark Twain and there's something about this river that inspires me to to realize and delve deeper into the interconnection of all things and the the currency, the energy the currency that flows through all of us. You know, just like this river flows through the entire United States, from the north to the south, and you down to the Gulf of Mexico. We're a part of that continues to flow beyond our temporary manifestation. We're a part of something larger than ourselves. We're a part of something that inspires novels and music and films and photography. Just like this river has inspired the arts and the hearts and the minds and the spirits for thousands of years and thousands of years into the future. So thank you to the Mississippi River Thank you to this moment.